WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and currently we've got a mixed bag out here. The mix goes like this. It's the Russell that's off by one point. Otherwise, the other U.S. indices trading to the upside are flat. The Dow is up 65 points, two tenths. Two tenths for the S&P are 11 points. Flat for the S uh, NASDAQ 100, that's eight points. Seven tenths for the semis, a 26-point move there. Training's up 37. Gold's off 10 bucks right now, trading at 1960. Silver's down 14 pennies, trading at 24.82. Lights Recruit is up 69 cents at 76.34. Natural gas down two cents. 30-year Treasury printed out at 126.19. That is up full 13 ticks. Let's try to figure out what all that means by looking at that nine-panel market update chart. We begin in the upper left-hand corner. What do we see? We see a Rhodes momentum indicator top. You don't actually see that. You'll see that on the charts that we show during the Trader Z show. But that uh, conformed yesterday. We have a new profile that did form. Resistance levels up at 4609. Support is in a zone. The support zone is 4507, 4524. Spot volatility still below its 50 day exponential moving average. That is a uh, a bullish sign out there. If we take a look at the NQ, yesterday it also formed a Rhodes momentum indicator top. It also formed a new profile. It is bullish in structure and support, which is being tested again. It was tested yesterday and that held. That's down at 15,586. That's the level being tested as we speak right now. US dollar indexed completed a buy the deep point Gartley buy pattern. We talked about that a few days ago. Price yesterday closed above the top of its daily profile. We're trading above it right now. Odds favor a further move higher. Goldilocks is pulling back. It has a TD9 count top, maybe pulling back to test support. Support could be all the way back at 1944.50. That's the top of its daily profile. Silver. Silver does not have a topping signal, but it is does have a new profile. Resistance up at 2547 daily profile, that is, and support down at 2457. Lightspeed Crude continues to consolidate with inside its profile, its daily profile. Resistance continuing to stand at 77.15. Natural gas testing resistance as well. That's the top of its daily profile at 275. And finally, the 30-year Treasury. 30-year Treasury is trading in between its swing point low from back in March and has run all the way up to the top of its daily profile. Did that a couple days ago. That's up at 127.24. So you just have a good old-fashioned consolidation between those two price points. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show. But if you have to start your Friday, please have a fantastic one. Thanks so much for joining us. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.